Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest news and updates from around the world. Today, we have a significant development in Singapore's political scene. Former Speaker of Parliament, Tan Chuan Jin, and fellow People's Action Party, PAP, Member of Parliament, Cheng Li Hui, have resigned from Parliament and the PAP due to an inappropriate relationship that persisted despite being asked to end it. Let's dive into the details. Prime Minister Li Xianlong addressed the media earlier today, revealing that he had spoken to Tan Chuanjin about the relationship in February. During that conversation, Tan admitted his mistake and offered his resignation. However, it has now come to light that the relationship between Tan and Chen continued, prompting the Prime Minister to take immediate action. PM Li shared that he first became aware of the relationship between Tan and Cheng after the 2020 general election. Although the exact timeline of their relationship is unclear, both individuals were spoken to and counseled. Unfortunately, their inappropriate relationship persisted, leading to a hard conversation in February 2023, where Tan offered his resignation. PM Li accepted the resignation but emphasized the need to ensure the welfare of the residents in Tan's constituency before his departure. However, recently, PM Li received information that strongly suggested Tan and Cheng's relationship had continued. This revelation prompted the Prime Minister to take swift action, requiring Tan's immediate departure. Coincidentally, during this time, a video clip of Tan Court using unparliamentary language was circulating, further adding to the urgency of the situation. PM Lee stated that the inappropriate relationship between Tan and Cheng was a more serious matter than Tan's unparliamentary conduct because Tan held the position of Speaker of Parliament, while Cheng was a member of Parliament. According to PM Lee, such a relationship should never have existed in the first place. Cheng Li Hui, who had been a member of parliament for Tampines since 2015, was also counseled by PM Li in February. Despite this intervention, she chose to continue the relationship with Tan. When questioned about why the relationship was allowed to persist after it was discovered in 2020, PM Li explained that party members had been engaged with both Tan and Cheng from the moment they became aware of the situation until February 2023. Regrettably, their efforts to rectify the situation were unsuccessful. As a result of these events, PM Lee announced that a new speaker will be nominated and he will make a ministerial statement during the next parliament sitting on August 1. In the meantime, Deputy Speaker of Parliament Jessica Tan will assume the role of Acting Speaker. Minister for Culture, Community and Youth Edwin Tong will oversee the residents in Tan's Marine Parade constituency, while Minister for Social and Family Development Masago Zulkifli will handle the residents in Cheng's Tampines East constituency. In his letter of resignation, Tan Chuanjin expressed remorse for his use of unparliamentary language and acknowledged the additional harm he caused to his family. He wrote, I have let them down and recognized the need to take responsibility and focus on healing his family. Tan, who is 54 years old and married with two children, has decided to step away from politics to devote himself to his family. Cheng Li Hui, who is 47 years old and unmarried, also tendered her resignation and expressed her deep regret for leaving office under these circumstances. During the press conference, PM Lee expressed his disappointment, stating that Tan and Cheng had fallen short of the high standard of propriety and personal conduct expected from all PAP MPs. He highlighted the party's duty to uphold discipline and maintain a standard of conduct, as their paramount responsibility is to Parliament and the people of Singapore. Thank you for joining us today as we shared this significant development in Singapore's political landscape. We encourage you to leave your thoughts and comments down below. If you found this video informative, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more news updates. Until next time, stay tuned and stay informed.